I'm Tom from Do It Yourself Home Automation, and this is a look at my kick and play piano gym. It's this great product from Fisher Price, so you know you're getting really good quality. And um, this is a gym, a play gym that your kid can use all the way from when they're a newborn um, up to when they're a toddler. And I'll show exactly how that works. So when they're in that newborn phase, this is a kind of traditional um, gym where they can lie on this mat on their back. Um, the mat itself is washable. It's pretty sturdy. Um, I like to put, you know, towel down underneath it if I'm going to put it on a hardwood floor, but here on carpet it works great. Really vibrant colors, really great contrast, so it's something that um, if you're doing tummy time with them, it's interesting for them to look at on here. And then above it we have this, um, this kind of foam uh, uh, arch and then we've got various toys hanging off of that. So this has these kind of teething rings. Um, we've got this interesting almost tab length. If you know babies love to play with uh, with tabs on clothing. So this is almost like that. Um, animal theme throughout. So we've got a friendly lion on there. Um, a mirror. Babies obviously love to look at themselves. So you can orient this out to the side and just cinch this strap down and that gives them the ability to look up um, and see themselves and see their own face, which is great. Um, as they get bigger and are sitting up, you can also orient it as I have down here so they can sit in front of it. We've got a crinkly panda bear here. Again, lots of nice sensory elements to this. And then this more solid kind of teething, um, rubberized type of toy here. So this all floats above them when they're on their back. They can bat at these. As they get older, they can sit up and play with them. Um, and uh, another really cool thing with this and the kick and play element is beyond that just traditional gym, as they're lying on their back here, you can switch on the sound and then as they press any of these pedals on this piano, it'll actually play different notes and play different songs for them. So you can see, we've got some songs going on and we can choose our different stages. So the first, the first stage when they press the uh, any of these keys, it'll just play a song for them. So basically they're lying on their back, they're kicking kind of randomly at that point, and if they manage to press one of these, it's gonna play a, um, a song. Now that we're at the second stage, when they kick one of these, it's going to tell them the name of the animal that they're seeing on there. So we're gonna... And we're gonna get also the instrument. Animals play. Monkey. So monkey, got cymbals. We got the toucan, we've got um, a frog on there, elephant, and uh, the lion. So each one you're pressing, we get some sounds, we get the guitar, um, we get the animal identified. Now if we bump it up to the third stage. It's literally just playing um, piano notes. So that first stage, Again, um, hitting it one time, plays a whole song. I'm gonna shut this off. Um, and then as they advance, then hitting it will just play literally the note. So at that baby stage, um, you can just let them kind of have at it, and if they randomly hit it, you get a whole song. But as they become older, and especially as they become a toddler, they can actually learn to play simple melodies on this. So that's really great, it advances with them. And you know, obviously once they're at the age where they're um, a toddler, they're not gonna wanna lie on their back and kick this with their feet in order to play it. So um, the actual playing part here of the, uh, the piano detaches and you can unscrew these side pieces. I'm not gonna do it fully right now because I wanna keep this for my baby, but I can unscrew this and this piano comes off and it's got this handle and they can carry it around like a little keyboard or a little um, briefcase and they can play their piano um, on that stage three where they can choose their own notes. So, so there we go, the uh, Fisher Price Kick and Play Piano Gym. Here's the, uh, the whole thing. Um, and this does roll up, so you can roll this up if you wanna take this with you when you're traveling. This just easily pops out of the side, so you can fold everything down, um, take it to a friend's house, take it with you to keep them entertained while they're traveling. Um, and other things parents will like, there is an off switch. There is also a volume switch on here. And uh, you're probably gonna go through a lot of batteries. So changing the batteries is also really easy. You just unscrew that screw on the back 
and pop new batteries in and you're good to go. So you can keep using this indefinitely. Um, really great product, again, from baby all the way up to toddler.